My brothers and sisters, sisters, Bishop Cotter here. Once again, we continue to delve into living the gospel of life, a challenge to American Catholics. So I begin with this quote. We believe that the gospel of Jesus Christ is a gospel of life. It invites all persons and societies to a new life lived abundantly in respect for human dignity. And we believe that this gospel is not only a complement to American political principles, but also the cure for the spiritual sickness now infecting our society more than ever. As scripture says, no house can stand divided against itself. We cannot simultaneously commit ourselves to human rights and progress while eliminating or marginalizing the weakest among us. Nor can we practice the gospel of life only as a private piety. American Catholics must live it vigorously and publicly as a matter of national leadership and witness, or we will not live it at all. Not at all. May the Lord Jesus, his grace and mercy, fill us with those gifts and talents uh, the gifts of the Spirit that are necessary to uphold the gospel life in this day and age. As I said, you know, to counteract the spiritual sickness now infecting our society from this quote from the statement by the Catholic bishops of the United States on the gospel of life. Let us be disciples of life. May the Lord bless you. May he guide you. May he continue to give you the grace of perseverance to fight the good battle. The good battle. God bless you all.